celebrities are wearing on the red carpet. Some of us pay close attention to the hair as well. So today we're breaking down some looks from the Oscars with Jennifer Gutierrez. How are you? Getting award show inspo. Yes, I mean honestly, I love the red carpet. And yeah. two people that came into mind in particular was Tracy Ross. I love what she was wearing. She was yes. wearing this gorgeous gown, had this beautiful, beautiful cape. Yeah. And but the best part about it is that she's so embracing her natural curl, oh, her yeah. natural her natural texture, yeah. which is like amazing. Which is why I'm embracing my natural texture. You know, mine as well. I love it on um, you. It thank looks you. Great. Thank you. And so. But I love that she has this updo. We tend to, you know, blow out our hair when we're trying to do some kind of Fancy. updo. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know, and it's already done for us. So why, why fight it? You know. Right. So I'm going to show you guys quickly what I've, what um, Tracy has done. Yeah. So what I like to do is, so I'll separate these two pieces from the front. This is our uh, lovely model Peggy, by the yes. way, with the curls. So you could already see, like. Everything's basically done for you already yeah. because she has this beautiful texture in her hair. And you have gorgeous volume, yes, you know, exactly. when you have that texture. Exactly. So what's nice is that you, it's going to look full. A hundred percent. So you can already see. So now I'm going to grab some bobby pins and I'm just going to tuck some pieces and just start mimicking this low bun that she has. Just like this. And it was and super loose, right? Super the construction. loose. Yeah, you know, it's nothing too contrived, which I yeah. love, you know? And then what I'm going to grab, is, so I'm going to grab these pieces at the front. And she also had these little, you know... Tendrils. Tendrils, yeah. yes. Um, at the front, so it's not so yeah. stark and pulled back, you know? That's right. So super natural. So I'm just going to turn her quickly. And I'm just going to, you know, it, it's very loose, nothing too... Um, like I said, nothing contrived. Too yeah, exactly. Too contrived. Like, look how beautiful. I barely did it's anything. Beautiful. She can throw on a gown, and it's like, ooh, red carpet <laughs> night. Yeah, exactly. And honestly, five minutes. A couple of bobby pins. Exactly. You're ready to go. Exactly. And so what I love to do is, when That's I'm so done what I've done, I grab a little bit of a curl cream, and I just put a little bit in here. And this one in particular that I'm using is by Mark Anthony. And so I just kind of do this and. Just around these little these little bits, okay. just to rehydrate everything. Yeah. Because you know sometimes we get frizzy. Yeah. You know, it especially the ones is. right around the face because exactly. you might be sweating, you're exactly. rushing everywhere. They will frizz out. So, so you redefine them. Redefine them. Even in the back over here, we redefine. We we'll just kind of do this, and then I lock it in with my hydro lock. Ooh. This amazing mist. Okay. This one is also by Mark Anthony. Yeah. It gives the hair so much shine, yeah. and it doesn't weigh it down. Very it's nice. like the best thing ever. So beautiful. Take a look at Peggy. There she is with her Tracy Ross. Beautiful look. Okay, let's get some inspo from uh, Rebel Wilson now. Take a look at her picture, and we're going to go very old Hollywood glam with that on our next model. And um, a lot of people want to emulate that look. We see it a lot on a red carpet, but I think it is... It's a look that is timeless. It's never going out of style. It always looks incredible. I totally agree with you. Yeah. So I see this look all the time, and it, it doesn't go out of style. And yeah. I think everyone could wear this. But the trick, th though, is, is making sure that you're using a smaller curling iron. Oh. So this is a half inch. Okay. So what happens is when you're wrapping the hair and making sure that all the hair is going in the same direction yes. so that you get that beautiful S wave. wave. If you're kind of doing, you know, everything going back and forth, you're going to yeah. get a beach wave. And that's not what we're looking for. Got we it. actually want it to be more contrived. That's right. Right? Because it all has to be combed out and be exactly, smooth together. Exactly, exactly. And then when I'm ready to comb out, I use this nylon brush. Okay. Comb it out. I'm not going to do it now because, you know, it should look so pretty already. It's so perfect. <laughs> yeah. And, um, you know, you're going to brush it out and you're not going to get the frizz. Okay. And then using a smaller curling iron also will help because by the time you're out the door, put on your dress and everything, you're not going to get way down. Um, you're going to get that weight. Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. Um, so it's not going to it's not going to get weighed down. You're not going to lose the curl. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yes. 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 And then I'm going to finish it off with this beautiful on this brooch side? Yeah. on this side, of course. And we're just going to finish it off like this. I love that these hair accessories are in big, they, bold. They like the bus. Pretty. And they're, they're just, a lot of fun. Ugh, there Got we go. it. Beautiful. Good stuff. So you have the deep side part. Exactly. That looks so good. And then finishing and it off again. Right Very on the nice. ends, because we tend to touch our ends a lot. Yeah. We finish it off, and it just gives it that shine, and it holds nice your... Nice bounce, uh, too. Exactly. Really good, Jennifer.